Hi, Jeff Carty here with Central Montana Avalanche Center up in the Rattlesnake today to see how the snowpack is reacting to all this warmth. And what we're finding is that everything is affected now. We're on a north face here at 7,400 feet. Uh, these had been staying dry until about a couple of days ago. Um, but we finally lost that. This is really moist right now. And that moisture extends about a foot below the surface here. We've got dry snow down below that. Here's our January 13th crust. It's pretty uniform to there. And amazingly in this spot, we're still finding some of those loose dry facets that are quite a bit softer. Um, these are slowly rounding and it's just surprising to find these this advanced in this spot. But these are the sort of pockets in the shallower snowpack where you might still find these on north aspects. We're at the point where it's unlikely you're gonna trigger these but that slight possibility exists. If you dig a pit, get down below the uh, January 13th rain crust, look for those softer facets down there, and that could be a warning sign. Um, south faces from here, everything south facing is totally saturated from the top to the bottom of the snowpack. Lower elevations have melted off drastically, and if we get the refreeze we're supposed to get tonight with temperatures dropping to the low 20s, things should lock up pretty solid. And uh, barring a bunch of snow, it's probably unlikely to trigger anything. Ski and ride safe.